What's going on YouTube? It is Daily Boosters and welcome back to the channel. I want to thank you for the few who are watching and liking the videos every day. Um, it just makes me want to keep going even though it's only a few of you. Um, the lottery channel took a little bit to take off so hopefully this channel can do the same. Um, but it's Sunday so we're going to do a larger product opening. I hope you're having a good weekend. And as you can see we have a Rivals of Exelon pre-release pack. I really enjoy pre-release packs. They are probably one of my favorite products to open. Just because, I don't know, you get a good amount of boosters, you get a promo card, and a life counter, and I just like the small little box that they come in. Um, so, that's why I'll be doing a lot of different sets, pre-release kits. Let's get crack right into this. Cannot wait for a... Uh, Core set 19 to come out. A lot of new Planeswalker decks and obviously a new pre release deck or pack is going to come out. Let's get into this and try and, ooh, try and hide that promo. There we go. So we get six booster packs. Yes, a new life die to, uh, Life counter die to add to the collection. Divider, a little booklet. Building a sealed deck, blah, blah, blah. Nice little uh, saying there. Divider, I think I showed that. Here's the promo card. Four packs of Rivals of Exelon. I actually remember going to this pre-release at the uh, local game store and two Exelon packs. It's pretty fun. Let's get right into the uh, Exelon packs, see if we cannot pull something fantastic. Let me know what the last pre-release uh, set that you went to if you go to your local game store. Skyblade of Legion is the first card. Skitter and Heartstopper, Dual Shot, Slash of Talons, Sailor of Means. Exelon was one of my favorite sets just because of the Whatley Planeswalker and all the dinosaurs. I made a pretty nice dinosaur deck. Spike Tailed Cer Ceratops, Gilded Sentinel, Sentinel, Unfriendly Fire, Cancel, Colossal Dreadmaw, 6 6 Dino, and the first uncommon is Steadfast. Armasaur, 2-3 with Vigilance, and you can see what his other ability is. Dead Eye Plunders, Plunderers, I always say that wrong. Human Pirate, 3-3. Three, three. Our last uncommon is Adento Vanguard, a Vampire Soldier, 1-1. One, one. And the first rare is Old Growth Dryads. When Old Growth Dryads enters the battlefield, each opponent may search his or her library for a basic land card, put it on the battlefield tap, then shuffle his or her library. That's pretty good for my uh, landfall deck if I choose to put it in there. Planes and a dinosaur token. Keep the rares up here. See, what are we hoping to pull? An Angarth? That would be cool. Nice little Angarth. March of the De of the Drowned. From uh, Exelon, we're trying to pull a Carnage Tyrant, maybe. A Ryle. I don't know how much Carnage Tyrant is anymore, uh, money-wise. I've pulled, like, two of them. Shorekeeper, River Herald's Boon, Tetarial Hammer Skull, Direfleet Interloper, Swashbuckling, it's a funny name, Siren's Roost, uh, Unknown Shores, first uncommon is um, Verdant Rebirth, Bishop of the Bloodstained, a 3-3 Vampire Cleric, Dead Eyes Quartermaster, Human Pirate 2-2, and we get the band card, Rampaging Ferocidon. 3-3 three, three, Menace, players can't gain life. Whenever another creature enters the battlefield, Rampage and Ferocidon deals 1 damage to that creature's controller. And we have a nice little uh, foil here, Bishop's Soldier. Let's 
So let's see, we'll put... Don't have a lot of room uh, with this damn camera recording on. First Rivals pack. Sanguine Glorifier, Vampire Cleric, Spy Spire Winder, 2-3 Snake. I don't think I've ever seen that card. Brazen Freebooter, Human Pirate, Knight of the Stampede, Human Knight, Recover, Plummet, Soul of Rapids, Soul of the Rapids, Evolve in Wilds, Bombard, First Uncommon, Cherished Hatchling, 2-1 Dinosaur, Relentless Raptor, I always like playing that in the Huatli deck, Ragin Regisaur, also played that, and the rare is... Admiral's Order, and I think we have a uh, another foil behind here. Um, so this rare is a two um, two island, one mana, instant raid. If you attacked with a creature this turn, you may pay one island rather than pay this spell's mana cost counter target spell. And we do have another foil, Dusk Charger, a 3-3 three, three horse. Come on now. Ooh, that was a bad opening there. Moment of Triumph. Crashing Tide. It's cool uh, artwork. Araska Raptor 3 4. Dinosaur Hunter. Aggressive Urge. Canal Monitor. Monitor. 5-3 Lizard, Impale, Bombard, Snubhorn Sentry, Kite Sail Corsair, First Uncommon, Forerunner of the Empire, Human Soldier, Jungle Creeper, Elemental, that's pretty cool, add to my Elemental pile, there goes my dog, Arter Arterial Flow, and the rare, Sphinx Decree, or Decree. Each opponent can't cast instant or sorcery spells during that player's next turn. So we aren't getting any uh, super good cards yet. Only two packs left. Hopefully we can pull a Mythic. Yeah, a big pile of trash over there. That's why I like these. They take a while to open and they're just pretty... You get a lot of cards. Suncrested... How do you say that word? Pterodon, I guess. P is silent, right? As you can tell, my pronunciation of words is not the greatest, but what can you do? Goblin Trailblazer. Legion Conquistador. Vampire Soldier. Canal Monitor. Guilt Grove Stalker. Merefolk Warrior. Squire's Devotion. Dead Eye Rig Hauler. Human Pirate. A Shatter. Destroy Target Artifact. A Gleeman Barrier and 04 Artifact Creature Wall. Ex Exultant Sky Marcher Vampire Soldier. First Uncommon Forerunner of the Legion. Or the Legion. 2 2. Arterial Flow. Arteri I guess that's how you say that damn word. Arterial Flow. Threshing Brontodon. 3 4. And the rare is. Ugh. Come on. Rares is bounty. For each land you control, create a colorless treasure artifact token with tap. Sacrifice this artifact at one mana of any color to your mana pool. So that's a good card, but look at the damn mana cost. Seven. Seven. That's a lot. Only one pack left. And then the uh, promo. Come on, last pack magic, as they like to say. This is magic, for crying out loud. I am actually headed to my buddies to play magic after this. Oraska Raptor. Raptor Companion. First one of that. Spire Winder. 2-3 Snake again. Hardy Veteran. Human Warrior. Voracious Vampire. Voracious Vampire. Let me know. Uh, it's a Vampire Knight. Cleansing Ray. Water Knot. Oraska Relic. So I guess that's that dead Oraska Raptor. Poor guy. Squire's Devotion. Secrets of 
the golden city. Yeah, I forgot this has a send in this set. Um, or the city's blessing. I mean, not a send. Blah, blah. Um, first uncommon. That's pretty cool. A harpy. I don't think I've ever seen this. Here we go again. Mausoleum harpy. Mausoleum harpy. Flying. 3-3. Three, three. Whenever another creature you control dies, if you have the city's blessing, put a plus one, plus one counter on. Blah, blah. Harpy. Blah, blah. Pretty cool. Siren Reaver, last uncommon, Pride of Conquerors, and the rare. Do we even have a rare? I don't think we even have a rare. Oh, we have a rare. Dun, da, da, da. I've never seen this rare. Path of Metal, legendary enchantment. When Path of Metal enters the battlefield, it deals one damage to each creature that doesn't have first strike, double strike, vigilance, or haste. Whenever you attack with at least two creatures that have first strike, double strike, vigilance, and or haste, transform Path of Metal. Ba -ba. That's cool. Um, becomes Mitzali, Tower of Triumph, Legendary Land. Tap, add one mana of any color to your mana pool. One mana, one mountain, and tap it. Mitzali, Tower of Triumph, deals two damage to each opponent. Or two mana and one planes. Tap, choose a creature at random that attack this turn. Destroy that creature. Not bad. And a vampire token. Only one thing left to do with this pre-release pack, and that is to flip this. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, it's a mythic. Ha <laughs> ha, what a way to end it. How about that? And I'm actually in the middle of collecting cards for a Sphinx deck. I know I'm, I say I'm making a lot of decks. Uh, it's only a couple, really. Um, I'm in the process of making the Gideon Human deck. I'm going to make an Elemental deck, and I'm going to make a Sphinx deck. Um, maybe a few other things, but this is awesome. Azor, the Lawbringer, Legendary Creature, Sphinx, Flying, 6-6. Six, six. And it doesn't cost that much. It costs 6 to play. Um, when Azor, the Lawbringer, enters the battlefield, each opponent can't cast instant or sorcery spells during that player's next turn. Whenever Azor attacks, you may pay X mana, 1 plane, 2 island. If you do, you gain X life and draw X cards. That's pretty cool. I'm going to keep it in that. So that is an Exelon pre-release kit. Please leave a like for this video. Please subscribe for more videos. Be sure to tune in tomorrow where we get back to cracking only one pack uh, during the week. And until then, have a good weekend. Peace.